So in one of my videos, I talk about how charge controllers are designed to release 60 to 70 percent of energy which they get from the solar panels to your battery in order for your battery not to get damaged. A lot of people came and be like, I don't understand what I'm saying. Uh, MPPT are designed to have 98 percent efficiency. Just read these two comments I'll be putting on the video. Then tell me if it's actually giving the 98 percent or its theory. Now, a lot of people have reached out to me on stuff like this, though these are the two I was able to remember because I want to do this video. I went through my messages, you know, I do have a lot of messages like this, but these are the two. The other one is from Instagram. This other one is from TikTok. He said he have about 10 units or, or he have 10 units of 500 watt solar panels, but he can only generate 2.5 kilowatt from the panels. That is 2,500 watt. Is that 98% efficiency or 50%? The second person also said he have about 12 units of 300 watt solar panels, but the maximum he's seen is 1,200 to 1,400 watts. Where is the efficiency of the MPPT? There are a lot of questions you should be, we should be asking ourselves, and there are a lot of things we should ask the manufacturer. Are they giving us the right stuff, or they are just using theory to sell out stuff that have little value? Yes, because you cannot use a lot of money to buy that charge controller. At the end of the day, you are getting 1,200 watt to 1,400 watt, or you are getting 2,500 watt from uh, your power, which you are generating close to 5,000 watt, or you are generating 3,600 watt. A lot of you don't know what you are doing, and you are some of the problem we are having. Technologies, most of these technology are not 100% or 98% according to what they say, but because you are after money, you don't want to tell people the truth. And for those of you that have been having this misconception about MPPT, MPPT is not an energy booster because that is most of the lies you installers are doing outside there. You go tell people MPPT is an energy booster, it will boost your energy. It doesn't boost any energy. It only converts the voltage into current, which at the end of the day, you will still not get more than what you are generating from your solar PV. So you guys should change your lies. You guys are lying too much. Come and attack me. You guys are lying too much. Your lies are much. Yes. You've read that comment, the person has 5,000 watt uh, solar PV on his roof and is generating 2,500 watt. Later, you guys will come out and say MPPT have 98% efficiency. Energy, uh, MPPT is an energy booster. MPPT is not designed to boost energy. Rather, it's designed to convert the voltage back into current, which at the end of the day, you don't get the same amount of energy you're generating from the sun. So you guys can keep arguing and I'll keep telling you guys the truth. When you're done with your installation, take out time, sit down there, study it, look at what your charge controller is giving out from the solar panels don't just be spreading the theory which you are taught or this theory which you see on the internet i do my thing based on what i see on the charge controller and that is reality